Hi guys, welcome to Unilove. And today we're going to be doing our spirit talks tonight about consistency. So I guess, <clears throat> to be honest with you guys, I'm going to be completely transparent. I thought I was going to be able to go live with this segment of my channel, Spirit Talks. But it looks like my page does not re meet the requirements just yet. So I'm just going to shoot this one all the way through one shot. Whatever mistakes are in here are going to stay in here. We're going to keep this one short and sweet because this segment of my channel is supposed to be short and sweet. Short and sweet. And so that, I mean, it is what it is. Until we get to the point where we need to get to, then we're just going to keep it pushing. And that's so interesting that this situation aligns with what I was going to talk about today. And today, <clears throat> on my spirit talk, on You Know Love Spirit Talk, I was going to talk about the word consistency. Um... I guess you could say at the beginning of this segment of the channel, I, we can call it spirit vocab or whatnot, because I'm only going to be talking about these words until I feel like I'm at a place where I want to share teachings with you guys. But until then, I'm just going to be doing words, how they apply to me, how I've been, how they apply to me spiritually, how I've been applying them to my life, and you know how much further that I'm going to be taking them, how I define these words, and how this word is important if you want to live this kind of lifestyle and by this kind of lifestyle I mean a lifestyle where you're not necessarily going after a higher deity but somewhat chasing your peace and oneness with self so the word consistency if I had to define the word consistency I would co define it as the act of continuation and completion meaning that any task that I set myself to do I do it completely and I do it um, thoroughly I don't and I do this with the intention of doing it until I'm satisfied so that's why I say a completion how this aligns with me right now is that I'm holding myself to the standard of being more consistent with everything that I do in every aspect of my life so I'm not quitting jobs as easily if things don't um, you know look at that time bright I'm looking to see what all of, all of my options are to change my outcome before I just decide to call it quits you know that's one way that we don't give up and that's one way that we can keep the consistency because you'll never know how things might work out the next week and the next week before you just think that you know throw it up and call quits on everything just see how the situation is going to go first so you don't have to be so extreme um, it definitely needs determination but it also with determination you also need discipline you know de determination so you won't get discouraged and discipline so that way you won't forget why you're doing it what do you need to be consistent for for me I need to be consistent because I want success but you can't get success by doing it in bits and pieces you can only get success by doing it you feel me in a, in a steady motion you keep going the current of the river never stops. It keeps going at the same pace. And the only way that it's going to change is if it rains <laughs> or if it dries up. <clears throat> Until then, it doesn't change. So that way, the pace that you do your things, as long as you know what your God goals are and you have a focus on what your goals are, then they shouldn't change. So it's okay to slow down. You don't have to rush, rush, rush. Like for me, I am trying to, I said it in multiple videos before that I'm trying to load you guys up with content but I'm not going to try to you know record all these videos in one day and then drop them all at once no it's going to be over a course of time so that way I'll be able to factor in my job you know other jobs other projects that I have going on and being a mom I'm in a relationship I got a lot of stuff going on in my personal life so I can't dedicate 24 hours to YouTube and with me doing it this method that I decided to do I don't have to as long as I stay consistent with some of the things if I go to a store make content while you're at the store the stores that you already go to you understand so as long as you stay consistent in your goal then you're not losing anything it is okay to slow down and just plan things out see how things go put your feet inside of the water and see if you even want to swim before you commit yourself because consistency commitment they're one and the same so you have to make that commitment to keep moving forward, commitment with yourself. Um, for me, I know that if I were able to go live tonight, there was going to be nobody on that live. But there wasn't going to be nobody on the live because I wasn't consistent. This is step one, a commitment that I've already decided that I was going to take. So with me deciding that YouTube is going to be this commitment that I'm going to take, 
then I need to understand that it's not going to happen fast. It's not going to be 1,000 people subscribing to me the first day because I don't have the clout for that. And I have to build up my following. And that is okay. That is okay. That's not to be discouraged or to cons or to compare myself with other people who have, have the opportunity of getting monetized right as soon as they drop their first video. That's not my lifestyle. I'm still going to be able to get where they are. I just have to do my path, stay on my path, and be consistent in my path if being monetized is my goal. So that's the reason why I've challenged myself to be consistent with the, the 30 days, 60 days. Well, now I'm just going to do 30 days. So that's why I decided that these kind of videos are just going to be one shot because I'm, I'm not able to go live. I thought I was going to be able to go live with this segment, but I'm not, and that's okay. You know, it taught me a lesson. Life's going to throw loops at you, and it is going live is an option, but I don't, you know, on my on my menu it's an option, but I can't utilize that option yet. But that's because YouTube is trying to encourage me to go further, and you know, no noticing that this is one of the things that I want to do. Going live is one of the things that I want to do. I can't look at that obstacle and think, huh, no, one monkey don't stop the show. I got to keep pushing forward. And that is the literal definition of consistency. Finding a way to still being able to cross the bridge and go forward with your path. So, for me, like I said, spiritually, um, I'm going to be telling you guys how I align with those things in my life. So, spiritually, how I'm going to be staying consistent. I've actually been meditating in the morning. I'm suffering from postpartum depression. Actually, it might be hard to believe because I'm doing these videos, but I just made... A decision for myself that <clears throat> my daughter is going to have a better life than I had and if being a content creator is one way that I'm going to be able to provide for her and also be able to do the things that I want to do I've seen it happen for other people then I've decided that I'm going to have that same drive and determination and that I'm going to get it done so I have to motivate myself every day I have to motivate myself every day and so for me meditation and also I've started challenging myself to listen to audiobooks every day every single day I have to listen to 30 minutes of a motivational audiobook myself I challenge myself and meditating and spending the time in the morning I spend that time with my daughter right as soon as we wake up smile at her play with her make her feel happy you know Give, dedicate that time to her every single morning I've been doing that now for the last two weeks to prepare myself to prepare myself to be consistent to this YouTube channel so now I'm adding different segments of my life I'm adding these segments in my life and I want these segments <laughs> I wanted these segments in my life to change because they were just it was just kind of me doing whatever finding something to do to pass the time overindulging on some things and so now that I've actually am going to take this energy and be creative with this energy I'm changing the segments of my life because I can control those segments of my life and waking up with my daughter and playing with her for 15 minutes 20 minutes the first thing in the morning that's not too much you know spending 20 minutes at the end of my night it's 15 20 30 minutes at the end of my night recording a video to upload it just boom boom put the words on there what I'm talking about and upload it that's not too much you know finding out my differences with people and talking out and finding out my differences with people so that way I'll be able to keep the opportunities that I have in my life changing my mindset and consistently continually growing that's not too much so if I want that growth for myself then I am going to have to be consistent with the things I see my end and I have to be consistent with my path. <clears throat> the, the act of continuation. The act of actually going and going and going and going. That's how I would define it. That's not Webster's Dictionary. This is Una's Dictionary. <clears throat> of continuation and completion. Right? Until I reach my goal. Until I'm at that finish line. Then I can determine with that segment of my life. What am I going to do next? But until you reach there, you keep going with the race until you reach the goal. <clears throat> yes, I do have notes. <laughs> I have um, 
a quote that I want to share with you guys from the late and the great Bruce Lee. Long-term consistency beats short-term intensity. <sighs> Long-term consistency beats short-term intensity. As much energy as you want to use, like I said before, <coughs> excuse me guys, <coughs> I can record all of these videos and I can drop them all at once, but... <coughs> That would leave a period of time. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. That would leave a period of time on my channel where there is no, <coughs> excuse me, no movement, <coughs> nothing active because I dropped them all at once. So it would be better for you to spread them all out. <coughs> Do content every day. As long as you have them set, you don't have to rush and try to do it. As long as you do content every day, you'll always have a video. So I'm going to always try to have something for you guys every single day for the next 30 days. I'm new to the game, but I'm about to stay true to the game. So, <clears throat> once you make the decision, <clears throat> once you make that decision, move, move in that stint, move in that decision proudly. Don't do anything that you wouldn't be able to hold your head up high, like an unethical, unmoral. If you know that you don't have the conscience to do that kind of things, then don't do it. You know, there's always an opportunity for you to do things the right way if you want to. <clears throat> and I'm not here to tell you that going to light or dark is right or wrong. That's not what I'm here to do. I'm here to tell you that whatever you decide to do, do it wholly. Continue it until you complete it that's what I'm here to tell you that's my word of consistency um, with the spirit talks thank you guys for watching this um, if you guys have anything that you want to say below go ahead and share those comments with me um, I'm really excited to see you guys I'm really excited to interact with you guys and um, if there's anything in particular that you feel like I should have to do with this channel um, for growth or anything that you want to see on spirit talks or any other segments of my channel let me know. Feel free to let me know. So, hopefully we can make this part of the channel more intimate and I can connect with you guys. And then eventually when I get comfortable, we can go into more of a teaching aspect um, with that area of my life. So, I wanted to share that with you and I wanted to share the word of consistency with you. Um, <clears throat> and I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that, you know, one, two, three, four, they all move up. It's one. It's one number at a time, but it's still going forward. And you can get to 100, one number at a time. So me, I'm trying my hardest to get to 100, 100 subscribers, one number at a time. I have my goal. I have my finish line set. And I have multiple places in between where I hand the baton off, you feel me, with other areas, other different segments of that race, that same race, but I hand the baton off because I'm at another level. So, you know, 100 subscribers is just one level where I would hand up a turn off to trying to get 1,000 subscribers. And actually feeling like because I hit the number with three digits in it, that I can hit the number with four digits in it. You feel me? So, one step at a time. I'm trying it. I understand 1 plus 1 equals 2, plus 1 equals 3, plus 1 equals 4, and we go, go up at a steady incline. But... <clears throat> The rabbit and the turtle finished the race. <laughs> both the rabbit and the turtle finished the race. And both of them wanted to finish the race. And both of them did. Even though they had intentions on finding out who was going to win the race.